Good evening, YouTubers. New Thai Travel Jaime 88 here. I'm back with another video. And welcome to the 15th episode of I Came Across a VHS Tape, a new series on YouTube, a weekly series. Anyway, today I'm going to be talking about Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Yes, the original VHS release. Ah, this the one we used to have once upon a time. Now, even though Wikipedia said that this tape came out in February 1990, well, that is incorrect. Because I look it up on my Google Book archive, it says that the last Indiana Jones of the Last Crusade made its home video release in October 24th, on October 24th, 1989. So, check, because the t that's according to the, the street date and the, the information on the tape itself, on the copyright date. <clears throat> anyway, um... <clears throat> How we, how my mom <clears throat> discovered of Indiana Jones of the Last Crusade? Well, well, my mom is watching a primetime show and then a VHS commercial of Indiana Jones of the Last Crusade. She went to the now defunct Sam Goody's, or no, Suncoast, down at the gallery and purchased Indiana Jones. The, it was on sale for it was on new release for twenty four ninety nine, and so I went ahead and got the tape, and we went home after we purchased it. We watched it. My mom watched the movie one time. Then, then we decided to um watch the movie again. Then, unfortunately, the sad thing happened that Indiana Jones Last Crusade. <clears throat> was presumed destroyed during while we're in moving to the new house or we yes destroyed it. so um, we kind of bummed out on that and so we got the tape again it was a 1999 letterbox edition which I I got it downstairs but I'm that tape needs a new copy <clears throat> So we went to um, the thrift store, Value Village, in 2008, and it was, and I finally got this. This was part of the Indiana Jones trilogy box set. This one was opened up and used, while Raiders of the Lost Ark and the Temple of Doom were never opened, still in factory shrink wrap. So after that, we test this tape out again. And indeed, it is the same original copy that we got it years ago. And I'm so happy I came across this tape again. <clears throat> Sorry for my um, voice is kind of um, dry because I'm just having a due to a cough or cold. Indiana Jones of the Last Crusade is the best movie of 1989. Great music, composers, and other stunt sequence and actions. All the stunt chases around it. Oh, sorry guys. I get. I don't want to give too many spoilers on that. Sorry guys. So anyway, if you haven't got this, this will be a definite recommend for the Indiana Jones series. Anyway, the tape itself, the cover art looks exactly like the ones we used to have once upon a time. There's um, Henry Jones, Indiana Jones, Sala, Marcus Brody, Elsa, and a Nazi guy. Here's the front. Here's the spine. Here's the other spine. The top and the back. This is the only first Indiana Jones movie to carry the PG-13 rating. And if you look around here, it says here, focus, I don't want to focus here. It says, see that? It says 1989, not 
Here's the sticker label right here. That's the Paramount logo. And this is printing on the 51st week of 1989. But my cop, the original copy that we used to have is on the first third week of 1989. So this copy opens up with a Diet Coke commercial, which is identical to that used to have. Then it has the Paramount feature presentation logo, 1989 with the warning screen. The Paramount picture variant from 1954 and go right to the film. At the end, it has the 1988 Paramount picture logo plastering the 1975 logo at the end. Surprisingly, the 1996 um, copy restores the, the original Paramount logo. And on the 1999 and 2003 special edition release. Yup. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I know I did. Make sure you guys to rate, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you guys to check back next week for my another episode of I Came Across a VHS Tape. We'll look at Pinocchio. See you next time, everyone.